not back, I mean? We can, uh, we can press on. I'm just kind of stuck waiting for this dog now. Waiting for it to poop. Okay, um, everybody should be back in the keep map. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay. Finish our rest. Uh, well, it, it was Madame Belden's rest, and then... Yeah, no, we're good. Um, so... Oh, thank God. Oh. Okay. I'm going to... I'm going to give you your torch back. And then I'm going to delete that torch. Okay, I did give it to the right. So, yes, yeah, so you guys have completed your long rest. Sweet. Oh, sweet key. Oh, my God. I love it. Oh, I just realized what you meant. I was like, what key is he talking about? <laughs> the sweet cat. Yeah. Oh, no. The power within oneself. Yeah. But more specifically, the fucking thing I need to do anything. Yeah, yeah, yeah no. <laughs> I, I've always read it as chi. I just hate that they write it with a K. Yeah. Yeah, I was down to no spell slots and no sorcery points. <laughs> yeah, it was that, that's that's good. That's good. That means that you know that was the appropriate amount of you know exercise, so to speak. Yeah, you got to tear the muscle so it strong grows back stronger. Exactly. Oof. And in my case, you got to make rip a big enough hole that it grows back stronger, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Punch sure. a big enough hole in your gut, and the scar <laughs> tissue will be tougher than the, <laughs> the weak paper skin that was there before. Yeah! <laughs> Come on, punch me! <laughs> so, no. Okay. Uh, I suppose we should head on in. Not hang out where the scary ghoulies were. Yeah, that's probably smart. Um, Yeah. So as you return... uh... No, no, that's right. Everything is exactly as you left it. Cool. Uh, I'm going to suggest that Chains, you scout ahead. Because you're the quietest one out of all of us. Oh, you're such a charmer. I mean, you got those boots. Time to put you to work. Yeah. Went from charming to not charming. That's why I wanted you to have those boots, because I wanted a scout. (laughs) You didn't already have one. Uh, How many times have you gotten caught? (laughs) I love the turning. It's so good. Do uh do you want to give me back my cone or you, do you care? Um, it's just easier if you don't have it. I mean, your character's head can turn on a swivel, so um, okay. just just understand that your vi- you know your vision is only what you see ahead of. You. Understood. But the oh, the way that D and D works, like the way that D and D works. It, there's no reason for me not to just give you 360 degree vision because you can always just turn. Mm. I'm just, just gonna go ahead and take spin. this opportunity to up my mage armor. Okay, so you cast charged mage armor. I'm gonna follow cast... 10 feet behind him. Okay. Well, you can go back a little bit, Brady. I cast stealth on me. You cast stealth. <laughs> so everybody witnesses Jane like <laughs> wiggle his fingers and and say the magic words and then crouch. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but like you don't even hear it. Yeah. <laughs> There's a little butt dance. Yeah. Uh, butt dance. Just to be absolutely clear, these are path, all three of these. You don't you don't have to stay on the stone. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. So, so just to give you the idea of what you're looking at, it's like this is the old path that was, like, obviously that's what they built, but whatever creature tore out the walls widened them, if, I see. if that makes sense. Yep, okay. Oh, so this, this whole thing is a hole. 
I yeah. gotcha. So then, like, where all this debris is, isn't actually a doorway. It's like a doorway with ripped walls around it. Yes. Yeah, yes. okay, I see it now. Yeah. Chain creeps ahead. You don't um, mind me just going what, one at a time. What is that noise? That's my chair. <laughs> oh my God. More, more shop. <laughs> wow. You, you live in a, in a middle school shop class. I love it. <laughs> I hated middle school uh, shop. No, all right, hold on, stop for a sec. I need to give you a description of what. You... Um, so up ahead, as you as you peer around the corner here, you can make out what looks like a well constructed or or purposefully constructed barricade. Make a perception check. Okay. Um, lodged in front of. <laughs> launched in front of uh, a couple of the barrels. This ambient noise is perfect. A couple of the barrels. Um, you can uh, quite clearly see what looks like very hastily rigged pressure plates. Uh, maybe maybe tied up to some sort of alarm system, as you can make out um, a, a length of what looks to you like frayed rope or like they, they, they frayed a rope and took the long strands and have tied them together. And that is, uh, let me see if I can actually get something that's visible. So wait, what's tied together? Hold on. I'm trying to, I'm trying to find an asset that'll work, but there you go. That's not what I want. Fuck it, we'll just use it. So it looks like they've taken um, a rope and like pulled it apart into the, the finer like pieces. You know what I mean? Like usually rope is several braided pieces of twine. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So they, they've they've unraveled their rope so that it's much thinner and harder to spot and, and draped it across. But uh, you did manage to to see it as it was kind of crudely constructed. Is it taut? Yes. Oh. I, I, thought, I, I thought that was clear. Yeah, I'm just making sure that it wasn't just like laying on the ground. Um, is there anything over on this side? Or is it what just up against the wall? It it, it goes so it goes all the way up across and then runs back toward the room. Uh, this room? No, the oh, room it, that you're no. headed. To. Gotcha. All right. I will go ahead and avoid it. Okay. So you step forward and can see into the room. Uh, still pressed up against the wall. Uh, as you look in, you you can make out what appears to be a pair. I don't know why they're red, but um, you can see two things there, right? Uh, I can only see one. I wish it would show me what you can see. Yeah, that. Like, I wish there. I wish there were a way. That. Okay, so um, that's all you see. Mm -hmm. Well, let me fix the dynamic lighting. It looks like this is blocking light. Ah. How about that? Is that better? Yeah. Okay. I, so I, you, you see a pair of orcs with tired eyes just kind of like peering into the distance, both of them sitting with crossbows at the ready. Uh, I can clearly see them, right? Uh, I'm sure you can. I'm going to throw back a sign, like hold up two fingers, and then put my uh, finger to my mouth and like a shh. Okay. And is this debris looks like it cross, it's crossable? Or is this like uh, a, it's, it's a, a barricade. barricade? Yeah. And this is a wall, right? Yep. 
I'll just sneak my way back so I can explain. I tell okay. everyone what's up. Okay. Okay. Are you able to disarm the uh, alarm? Uh, depending on how it's set up, I should be able to. Okay. So what do we do about these orcs then? They uh, they appeared to be tired. We could try to take them by surprise and try to do it quietly. Okay. Or I could try to do it by surprise and do it quietly. Tell them a lullaby. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Allowed is uh, you do attack magic. I don't know. If... Sleep, little orky. <laughs> I don't know how it works. Lullabies go though. They're very loud and intrusive to the eardrum. Rip their hearts out, <laughs> smash their skulls. Lots of drums. <laughs> Anything you can bang a stick on, basically. Well, you that could also soothing. <laughs> yeah. You could also pretend you're one of them. That doesn't seem to work out for any of us when I do that. <laughs> Here's, I have a, I have a thought. What if we make some bone rattly sounds, and we can use some prestidigitation to show off like some purple glowy light, try to scare them away. Hmm. So you're assuming they know about the undead, which is probably why they barricaded up there. Yeah. Or we could try to take them by surprise, which would probably be more successful. I kind of like that idea. Mm, I mean, either way, if we fail, we will have to probably fight them. Yeah. Egg, How what do you think? How many are there again? He saw two. I only saw two. Oh, two's, two's probably not so bad. We should be able I mean, to take them out. Look, the fake... Skeleton idea is funny, but <laughs> it's just two words. So, we should be able to. So I like that one. But just so you guys remember, uh, after a long rest, you only gain back half of your spent hit dice. Oh. That is rounded down as well, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Always rock at D and D. Okay, um, I mean, we could bring them to us, too. I could call for help or something and see if we can take one of them out, one at a time. They have crossbows, so they're probably... It's not a bad idea. Like, they're probably on the lookout for anything moving in the vicinity. It might be better to hide out of line of sight and draw them into us. That could work. I like it. I could hide somewhere around. In some All right. Or... I guess I'm gonna do some disgusting shit here. Okay. Are we in agreement with this before I start doing what I'm gonna do? What are you gonna do? I look over to I the dead them. orc. Oh, you're not gonna eat him, are you? <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I don't know, you're just looking at the dead orc. The dead orc is, like, eating himself. He's gonna pretend he's... He's gonna, like, pretend he's injured. Yeah, <laughs> I'm not gonna eat yeah, the dead. Yeah, but you were dead. saying that it was disgusting, so I was confused. <laughs> I don't know what orcs do. <laughs> Damn, you need to get out, boy. Why was your first assumption I was gonna eat the dead? <laughs> I don't know! They're not the zombies. <laughs> I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna stand over here. I'm just gonna. Just, I'm just gonna grab all the guts and right. put them on himself. And that's it. Start that's basically the other no, monster. No, no, not I, that. I, 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 <laughs> so then the orcs would shoot him, right? Hide behind pillars. Plan to get the orcs to shoot him. Okay. That's, and that's our end goal here. What? What are before you start? Yeah. Rubbing viscera on yourself. That, yeah. 
Uh, <laughs> what are the odds that they would tear down their barricade? Tear down? No. They would probably send somebody to check it out, though. That's what I'm assuming. I don't think so they'll the tear down is... the barricade. Fully, anyway. So we're just trying Should... to draw them into this room. Yeah, where we can ambush them. Yeah. Or just thin the numbers. Should we at least try the, the purple light plan and see how they react to it? That could be part of this, frankly. They have crossbows. They're just going to shoot at whatever is purpley. That's kind of what I'm... them back here, I would have to put out my torch. Mm-hmm. This is why we need to have these discussions before we do things. <laughs> this is true. I say the, the mages uh, hide further away. Well, the thing about it is, is that we can only, like, make the the bone rattling noises and the purple light. Mm -hmm. So, and then we can only make it like. Can you make by, it look like so... my guts are like falling out or something? Yeah. Okay, with so what? I don't actually need to rub guts on me. With 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 no, what? No, but it would be funny if you with did. With what? Prestidigitation. No. Yeah. Huh? It is not minor illusion. It is prestidigitation. It is parlor trick. Out of character, that's what I was little, asking. <laughs> a little green. <laughs> I don't know what you guys have okay. in your arsenal. What What if we make a rock glow purple with prestidigitation, then use Mage Hand to go and carry that rock over to the barricade? Can you, can you Mage I Hand mean, the body? We can call that plan A, me plan B, and then just attack plan C. Yep. Oh, hold on. Can we mage hand the body? No, I think the mage hand can only do like 10 pounds, right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah it's not. Yeah. You might be able to Above do that, like I, an orc head. Float. <laughs> this is getting intense. Floating head sounds pretty good. <laughs> I like the floating head idea. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay well, take the head, make the head glow purple. Yeah, yeah. And then mage hand it over. Oh, jack o' lantern! I like it. Oh my god. This is wolf. If I uh, supercharge mage hand, hold on. That... Hold on. I need to look at something. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell me this wasn't part of your plan. Certainly, you saw this, this plan coming. This is so dumb. <laughs> I love it. So, press the digitation cannot make a purple light. You can make a color appear on an object, but you can't make a purple light. You can create sparks, but you can't make purple light. Don't you have, um... Someone had light, light cantrip, right? Yeah, but that's just a bright light. Right, and then make a glow purple with press the digitation. Yeah, you can have it... Can't you manifest the light as any color you want, though? That true. I don't actually know. Let me look it up. Touch one object no larger than ten feet. Sheds bright light. Light can be colored as you like. Weird. Oh, okay. <laughs> sure enough. <laughs> so I, the only reason I'm being a stickler about this is because prestidigitation is awesome, but it is not the spell that does everything. Right. Yeah. 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 yeah so. Well, I yeah. I keep forgetting that I don't have minor illusion because gnomes. Like, forest gnomes do, but I don't because I'm technically a half-elf, so mm -hmm. it's like... Gotcha. Okay. But yeah, I can... I can. Do we need the bone rattly sound, or do we just need the purple light? I mean, this is on you guys. This know. is plan I, A. I, I, I'll, I I'll the make the bone rattly be... sound, and then if you want to do the head mage hand purple light thing... Um, if I supercharge Mage Hand, would that double the distance? Uh, what kind? I, is is are you talking like? Because it's how, the what's the range, range of it? What's the range of it? Thirty. Thirty range. Um, 
let's say that's duration and effect. So duration effect improved by 50%. So let's say the effect can be the range. Okay, so 45 then? Yep. Okay, that should hopefully be enough. Uh, and then... Are you guys cutting off the head of the orc? Is that is that? I guess so. Sure are. Because we're doing the head instead of a rock, right? Okay. Yeah. I guess I'll start working on that. <laughs> <laughs> is uh is this spot standable? It's just the the rubble there. Hold on. I mean, I should probably. What's cut the, the orc what's head? Because I have your spear. Uh, what spot? Oh, yeah, you can stand there. It's just like cold, so that's fine. Um, I hate to be a pain in the ass again, but I can't see like things. Like when the light source was up, it was fine. Mm -hmm. Every time the torch goes out, everything goes completely dark. Not completely dark, sorry, but like unseeable. Like everything's weirdly transparent. Um. I'm guessing there's like wow. oh okay. This head's about to be a light source, so is that is uh it... the torch that you put back on? No. Oh, that's just how I I'm don't... supposed to see. Yeah, okay, that's fine. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We don't have a lit torch right now, do we? No. Yeah. Uh, so what's the what's the range on this head when it emits light? Uh, thirty. Thirty. No. Uh, 30 total, 10 bright, 20 dim. No, 20, 20. Can't fucking read. <laughs> 20, 20. So perfect vision. So 40. Yep. So, Egg, you helped me chop the head off, I guess? Yep. Cool. Oh, oh my gosh. god! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a very purple. <laughs> uh, why will it not let me change who controls this? That's weird. This is gonna scare the shit out of those orcs. <laughs> Scaring the shit out of me. There we go. You should be able to control the head now. I sure can. Yeah, this okay. is so beautiful. This is so fucking dumb. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> Wasting yeah, I'm going to use press the digitation to make a bone rattly sound. Okay. Are you doing that? I okay, am doing can I that. Be a pain in the ass. Um, I'm sure you can. Can you? <laughs> can, can I? Can I do light uncharged for half effect? That's okay. ten ten. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> so um I think that's Much the first time is that head. is that the is that the first time a spell has been cast uncharged? I don't think so. Uh, I think it's yeah, the first time like in a long time. Before. No, at, at any rate, uh as you manifest the spell, it's much more of a struggle uh to even, you know, make the magic work and as you do so, you get this this flickery little Dinky so, light. <laughs> as soon as it turned the corner, mm -hmm. I I can't see it anymore, so I can't <laughs> move it. Uh, let right me. There. Oh, hold on. I had to. <laughs> I had to futz with the dynamic lighting. Let's just say that you're. Is that better? Here. Yes. Yeah. Well, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. So the hand will bring the skull right in front of the barricade. Okay. And then pedal in. What's the range of prestidigitation? I think it's... Hang on, let me just... It's Is there just a 10... goal to this? 
Yeah. It's just, it's just, just scare uh, the shit out of the orcs. Okay. What's the what's the range? It's just ten feet, but I had intended to cast it in this room so they think like more are coming. Okay. You know? Okay. Mm. So you have a disembodied floating glowing purple head. Um and they probably want this chain to go and sneak up and look. I feel like that probably should have been discussed before the head started yeah, moving. <laughs> so, um, you hear the thwang of several crossbow bolts, and the mage hand can't keep its grip um, as the head comes tumbling back um, into the hallway itself, uh, now sporting a couple of large bolts through the skull. <laughs> Oh no, they wow. got him. You hear the uh the muffled <clears throat> grunts and and a few shouts. Uh in a in in orcish, but you can't quite make out what's being said thing. Okay. So plan B then? What's plan B again? Plan B is he rubs viscera all over himself. And call for help basically. <laughs> right, right. Yeah. Chain. If everyone's go, go take a look. Well, you okay. have to extinguish the light before he goes to take a look. Otherwise, they'll see him. Yep. Yeah, there's a cover in there. Well, it lasts an hour, and it's not a concentration. So. <laughs> 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 I mean, you can have the mage hand pick it back up. Oh, this is so good. <laughs> I just put a <laughs> spotlight just... under the path. <laughs> I'll, I'll have the the mage hand go and pick it up. And uh, how much do we say this head weighs? It's like eight pounds. Can uh, can I try and lob the head over the barricade? Yes. Um, let me look at the wording of mage hand before I say yes. <laughs> it just says it can't attack. Have an idea. Pedalin, summon a spirit weapon and bat it out of his mage hand. I don't think it has the force to throw. It can open doors, but like in my in my head is literally a hand. I think you need an arm to throw. Yeah, if that make yeah. Bat it away with the spirit weapon. You, got, you don't no need an arm to throw poorly. <laughs> you need an arm to lob. <laughs> like throw with your wrist. I, I want to. I want to see you pick up a ten-pound dumbbell and lob it without <laughs> using your arm. I didn't say we go very far. <laughs> okay. Well, while I still have mage hand, I'm going to keep picking it up and bringing it to the barricade. Okay. Okay. Oh, uh, I'm sure you guys can see down the hall. It looks like there are several more orcs now raiding, waiting at the ready. Um, a net is cast, and oh shit! Yeah, no. So your your head is now ensnared in a net. <laughs> they got him. And they 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 reel it towards themselves. You hear. Angry, muffled shouting. <laughs> yeah, let's just go with plan B. I'm starting to wonder now if they would even help. Because now that I'm thinking about how orcs are, it's like if I'm just like, I'm falling in battle, they'll be like, good. <laughs> Stay there. <laughs> Help, I'm falling Die. not in battle. You know what? We're gonna try it anyway. I'm gonna start... <laughs> I'm gonna put a bunch of the gross, like, guts and viscera from the ground in him into mm -hmm. my shirt and slice Fuck. it a little bit so it looks like okay. my guts are spilling out of my stomach. Um, sure. I feel I just like they're them. just gonna shoot you to, to put you out of your misery. Oh, I'm not we'll going into their range. Happens. <laughs> That's, oh, okay. That wasn't part of the plan. Just, so you're just gonna stand like right here. Yes, exactly. Okay. Why not right yeah. here? Well, no, just go right here, and then as soon as they come, not in the range of them shooting you, then I don't know that they'll be able to see the guts. <laughs> I'm not worried about them shooting at me. I don't care. They can. 
they probably will. Let's. I just start <laughs> screaming in orcish at them that the dead are coming back and I need assistance to hold them off. I'm badly wounded. Okay. Um, is that you just stand there and shout? I'm kind of like, I don't know, hobbling and like holding my stomach, making it very obvious, like squeezing a little bit of intestine out every now and then <laughs> to just be like, they're, uh, I need help holding them back. Okay. <laughs> so, but you're just standing there, right? You're not like moving toward them or anything? I mean, I'm hob I, like hobbling, but let's say that while I'm doing this, I probably end up here. Hey, okay. hey, Pedalin, take out your dagger. I have an idea. Okay. Uh -oh. Here. And then we start. We'll start sword fighting very loudly. Ding ding. <laughs> <laughs> and all while making the bone rattling sound. <laughs> ding ding. <laughs> I'm just imagining Palin actually just oh, saying Oh, this is ting. so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> I start waving at them like, help, come on, and then oh I'm going to start moving back. God. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Um... Yeah, we might just bring in a huge fucking force to attack us. No, not bad, but... Oh, that's fine, that's good. How much damage I do have, I take? I don't have, I don't have enough dice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a bad. That's bad. <laughs> so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. What? <laughs> so, okay. Fame yeah. is just a pin cushion <laughs> by crossbow bolts. Oh shit. <laughs> I, I did warn. Four of them striking critical areas. <laughs> oh my. All right. Sure. And, so, and one exploding off of the, the cave wall. The, the bolt explodes. Just like shatter. Okay, hold on. I got to <laughs> do the math in my head here. Ugh. So these are your rolls in the thing, then? Or did yeah, you roll some yeah. outside as well? No, that's that's it. That's all. That's all of them? Okay. Yeah. Is, is that how much damage? Yes. Yeah. yeah, we stopped sword fighting. Don't you have a thing to, like, catch projectiles? He does. Yeah. I do. Let's see. But... I was, yeah, I do, do have, have I do, do have, have to, to use it. it. Yeah. Because I was going to do something different, but it's not going to work out mathematically, Seriously, so. Get, get out from under my desk. Do this. Okay, so what do you say? 1d10 plus 7. Okay, so let's, all right. Um. So 6 on the first one. Three on the second one, eleven on the third one, thirteen on the fourth one, and seven on the last. When, but it's a reaction, so you only get one. <laughs> yes. Uh, so you'll you'll stop six. You'll stop six of the damage. Okay. Um, because that was the first one. Throw it back at him. I can't, because you got to reduce it to zero. Oh, yeah, you did. I I could. Yeah. <laughs> so that's, sure. That's right here. Um, twenty sixty. So, uh, pretty sure you have disadvantage. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you're a disadvantage, but you can still do it. I mean, why not? Yeah, why not exactly? Let's go disadvantage. I s just minus three from this because I stupidly didn't. Yeah, I have okay. 12. Okay. Well, uh. Let me look. That actually hits. 
<laughs> oh my god, that's stupid. You throw a bolt. Wait, wait, wait why minus three? Uh, it's, cause... it's... It's a monk weapon. You have proficiency. Really? Yeah, it, that's a, 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 a ranged does. attack as a monk weapon. Oh, yeah, okay. So, yeah, I mean, that so hits. yeah, that is 15 then. Yep, that hits. Okay. So, uh, roll monk weapon damage, which for you, is that a d6 now? Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yep. So, five. <laughs> All right, I'll tally that banana. Okay. Okay! So, how much uh, do I take instead then? So, as, uh, as Thame is, uh, like, you hear the doom, 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 doom of the, of the six crossbows, um, he should... Oh, you know what? He's not even in range to shoot at you, so... You actually take seven less. So you take 13 less than 40. So you take, uh, what is that, 27? 27. You take 27 damage. So, the first bolt comes whizzing by, and, and Thame catches it, and expertly uses the momentum of the bolt, like spins and hurls it back down the hallway, and you hear a gurgled grunt. Um, and then... As he's turning, four more bolts just boom, 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 lodge into him. So good. Yeah. Uh, okay. Um, uh, as they do, I'm going to oh, fall no, three. to the... Is that three? Yeah, three more bolts. I, I'm going to fall to the ground after they're all shot into me. Okay. And I'm just going to, like, obviously play dead so that, like, the people near me see that, like, I'm still, like awake but like mm. i'm just laying there make a performance check sure or 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 okay. uh just look at us and wink yeah i mean that's essentially <laughs> what i'm doing right like Ding. yeah but i'm still hurt so <laughs> well i don't I, I think that would be performance more so than deception so yeah performance sure. So, 17. Okay, so Thane puts on an excellent show, um, grasping at the air in his chest where one of the bolts is and falling forward to the ground. Maria. Everybody else make a perception check. Let's see if they catch on. <laughs> Egg, Madame Beldum, and Pedalin will all... No. Sir, I can't see. Whew. Thankfully, because oh, well, Chain is Egg a coward, doesn't... he probably won't do anything to avenge me. So, we're good. <laughs> um, so, so it's, it's an obvious deception to the ones that can see, uh, except for Chain, but yeah. with Pedalin being there, I mean, it's, it's pretty... So everybody knows that it's a deception. Okay. Um, now what? Yeah, I mean, uh, now, I, now I can't move. <laughs> so... I'm sitting here looking at 320s on my D20s and just like, holy fucking shit. <laughs> That's where all your good rolls are for the night. Maybe. Hopefully. Do it again, Shane. Do it again. That's all that happened. Also, <laughs> while they decide what they're going to do, the light thing for me is not working still. Again? Yeah. Are you sure that it's not like it's, so? You have low light vision. You don't have regular vision. Like your your dark. Right. There's no light source. Oh, so you right. should be okay. able to. Yeah, it's just a little hard to see some of them. Um. So if I do this, that might just be because for you. That's too bright now, though. Right. Yeah. So when I do it like this, it's your low light vision. Yeah, so it, it might just be, be the tokens might be blending it a little mm -hmm. bit. Yeah, that's the, probably the tokens it. should serve. Yeah, that, I think that's why I had them red before, so they were more visible. Gotcha. I, remember. No, I just noticed fine. that there were red orcs for some reason, and I was like, why are they red? Weird. Yeah. But yeah, okay. the tokens blend in a little bit, so just make sure you zoomed in. I'm going to mute now because I'm playing dead. <laughs> okay. Well, that didn't work out.
<laughs> we on. We could what throw planet? him a rope and drag him in. Okay. So. Do you want us to roll stealth? Well, you should have rolled stealth beforehand. It's too late now. Nobody, like, are you guys hiding? Is that why everybody's off in the corners? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, then roll stealth. Time was to ambush. Okay, then roll stealth. I hate you guys. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay. we don't have plus nine. <laughs> uh, so, uh, you might notice, uh, can, can, so who can see this orc in the hall? I can, I can barely see a vague outline. Of- okay. I cannot see him. Okay. So. I'm behind a column, I think. Sir? Oh, you don't have a light source anyway. Yes, also that. Chain can't be seen. Okay. Um, an orc appears to be advancing down the hallway. Uh, it looks like Madame Beldum, Pedalin, and maybe Chain can see. Uh, Chain remains hidden. The the creature is, like, she has her eyes locked on Thame, but, like, a, a, a slight movement or perhaps a piece of rubble being dislodged as, um, and again, Madame Beldum attempts to to you know shift their weight slightly so as not to give away does in fact give away their position, and she shouts something in Orcish before bolting back down the hallway. Fuck. Um. Fame, you're still alive and conscious, so you would have heard her say, "The imposters live." Uh, Prepare the defenses. Okay. Can we uh can we skip to plan E? Going all out and killing them? Plan Plan E sounds like what we were left with. Plan right. E is plan explosion down the hallway. I I like that plan. I'm that for it. That's pretty good. Yeah, I think when I hear her start running back yelling that, am I able to, like, spring myself up and try to take cover behind something so as to not sure. get shot instantly? Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, okay. they, they weren't ready. They thought you were dead. Um, so you're, you're able to get up and, and get into cover. Like, here. Um, like a mo- let's say a moment after you get behind the pillar, a crossbow bolt comes whizzing down the hall. Just poof. And clatters off the floor. So somebody was alert, but not they they were still, you know, not entirely ready. I wasn't pin cushioned. Correct. Okay. Again, I should say. <laughs> I'm gonna start it pulling was... bolts out of me and just be like, well, <laughs> what now? <laughs> Alright, here you go, Thane. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> So a question from, like, here, am I able to see, like, down that hallway? As, as long as you have line of sight, you can see. Like, if, if your character can see down that hallway, then you, you have line of sight. Unfortunately, I don't get to see from your perspective. So Man, They really should add that. Yeah, Not I, I that wish you can like, click on so, us. Yeah, I was gonna say like if I clicked on the character, it should show me what you see. Totally. Yeah. That would be sensible. <laughs> well, here we go. A Belden pincushion pin coming up. <laughs> so you're moving into there to do what? I'm guessing you're going to cast fire. That's the intention, but I just moved to check to see if I actually had line of sight or not. Okay. The lighting was all wonky. That's fine. Because I knew if I kind of walked in the way, I would get shot. Mm Mm-hmm. So I wouldn't just walk in the way. Sure. Uh, The fireball has... Wait the range. Mm-hmm. 
Mm, that's still in range, I guess. All right. Ah, corridors suck. Okay. So, yes, we will fireball, but we will supercharge it as well. Okay. And I will aim it past the barricade. Oh, I have to manually do it for supercharge, huh? Oh, uh, you you haven't put that in your... No, I wasn't expecting to use it so much. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Thame, real quick, you Can heal I step for back 10, once? right? Yeah. No, I heal for six. Yeah, oh, you yeah, higher leveled. For... Yeah. Okay. I just want to make sure you, got, you caught that. I didn't see the plus four. Thank you. Yep. Okay, um... So, Madam Beldum gets down on one knee, holds out her finger gun, supporting it with the other hand. <laughs> one eye closed, Amy. I love it. <laughs> love it. And uh, she aims for the uh, the purple light okay. that was uh, coming from the skull. Okay. Okay. And what's a, the... Uh, a streak of fire shoots out from her finger into a... 20 yard explosion. Nice. Originating here. Yep. That's. It should be. It's 20 across, right? It's not 20, because that would be 40. Okay. Yeah, it's so 20. It's, foot it's, radius. it's a 10 in any direction. Okay. Wait, 20 right, feet. Wait, 20 radius or 20 diameter? It's radius. So it's actually Jesus. 40. Whoa. Wow. Holy shit. Really? Holy fucking shit. <laughs> yeah. Good. Dang, girl! <laughs> she just fired a rocket launcher into that one. <laughs> RPG. Uh, I was reading it as diameter this whole time. That's more fucked than I thought. <laughs> what is it? Just fireball? Yeah. yeah. And that is a... Uh, DC 13 on Dex. Wow, okay, so that really is. So one, two, three, four. Holy fuck. <laughs> uh, does that hit? Um, yes, it does. Okay. Oh, dude. Oh, I, supposed uh, to Why wasn't this plan A? Seriously. I love the components. Yeah, I wouldn't have had the fireball. light to aim at. <laughs> so Tiny ball of bad shit and sulfur. <laughs> that's one way to solve a problem. <laughs> uh, at least the cave didn't collapse this time. Uh, still don't trust it. So the fireball just explodes. streaks out and explodes. <laughs> um, they're like dust as the cavern is rocked. But the dwarves were excellent craftsmen, and the keep holds up despite its ancient age. Uh, like the the dust fills the air of the of the path in front of you, and um, no sound can be heard from beyond. Oh shit, did you kill all of them? Oh, and you destroyed the head. <laughs> you, want to, you want me to check it out? Yes, it's dark now. Yep. <laughs> I ain't going back down that hallway. <laughs> so, so, Egg, <laughs> just for your sake, you uh -huh. see a blinding streak of fire shoot past you, hear the explosion, and now everybody's just kind of standing <laughs> in your in darkness. Uh huh. <laughs> well, that seemed good. Madam, that was awesome. Well done. I didn't expect that to work as well as it did. All right. Sneak sneaks way. down the hall. So I don't think. Uh, uh, as you step over the tripwire, um, 
you you feel that it has gone slack as whatever it was tied to before likely burned away. Um, uh, so you look into the room and can make out. Well, it looks like you can see four orc bodies, and um, there appears to be a lone orc sitting, up, leaning up against uh, what looks like a, a some sort of ceremonial table. Uh, so that somehow survived the blast as well with minimal scorch marks, and he's just like badly burned. You can see just like blisters still forming and charred black skin. It smells faintly of pork gone sour. Uh, oh. as as he like sputters and, and like his even his eyes are just burned out. Oh, fantastic just laying there against the table, gasping and trying to breathe and clearly in immense amounts of pain. Cool. I'm going to make my way up to him. Okay. As you step into the room... uh... I'm going to empty the guts Uh, out of my shirt. (laughs) <laughs> so it looks like this room uh, used to be some sort of ceremonial chamber based off the large, round, um, ec- like really intricately tar- carved wooden table at the center. Uh, however, recently there was some sort of cave in, uh, and-, and you can see that it's somewhat recent just because the the stone itself still has like that that newness about it. Like there's uh, no real dust except where it's been kicked up by the rocks having fallen. Uh, you can make out the corpses of several orcs buried underneath the rubble. Um, and other than that, so one, two, three, four, five orc corpses, the one badly burned one, and that's it for in here. Uh, you can see a path, I, I think you can see a path leading up to the north. I don't really know. I Again, I don't know what you see, so. Oh, uh, yeah, I can make out that there's... Yeah. Okay. Path up there and okay. then the rest of walls. It looks like there there might be a, a gap here in the rocks as well. Oh, cool. I'm gonna make my way up to him and like kick away his blade. Okay. His axe. Whatever he has, his weapon. Um, yeah, sure. You you kick the axe away and his his badly burned fingers feebly kind of grasp in the direction of it, uh, as his um empty eye sockets like gaze up to in, in your general direction his uh his mouth opening and closing not unlike a fish having been pulled from the water i'll yell back in elvish that it's clear yeah. you yell back that it's clear okay so i hear him in elvish yep. Yep. And I let everyone know that it's clear and that we can move forward. Well, then go ahead. I'll follow behind. I'll lean down towards can I the light orc. A torch. Or... <laughs> I mean, that's up to you. Do you want to light a torch? So this this trip wire is safe to step over now. I don't yes. know. Do you see a trip wire? I do. Barely. Do you? Yeah. You do not. Then why is it there? What do you mean, then why is it there? See it. I can. But she's talking about the rope that's there. I, I know what she's talking about, but like her care. The, did, did you ever mention that it was there? No. No. Okay. So then. Then you would probably, right. yeah. Are you lighting a torch, Egg? Is that yes. Okay. So, uh, Petalin steps into the tripwire, finds herself tangled in the rope, stumbles a moment, but is otherwise fine. Yay! So I'm gonna uh, lean down towards the orc. Like, Mm -hmm. not looking so good there, buddy. You speak common, right? And just kind of lets out a gurgling gasp. Can I can I start looting these other bodies, or are they just charred to bits? You can you can loot if you want. 
I want to loot. You can loot if you want to. You can leave y'all's friends behind. Okay. You're uh, trying to dig through the, the charred remains of the orcs here. Um, they've got some crudely fashioned weapons, mostly uh, short swords, long swords, or axes. Uh, let's see, so there's one, two, oh no, two scimitars, two axes, and two short swords. Uh, they, they would function fine as those weapons. Uh, they're just, like, crudely fashioned is all. Um, Shane, do you need another short sword? Yes. Here you go. Thank you. Thank you so much. There are there are two short swords, two scimitars, two battle axes. Are scimitars better? Hey, um, if you would like to arm yourself, I'd like my spear back. Okay. Do you hand it back to me then? <laughs> yes. I okay, do. cool. Just for my notes to make sure I have it. So six six chain shirts as well for okay. armor. Um, I will take a chain shirt. But we'll get to that in a second. And then uh, yeah, sure. Let's say Between them, around 50 silver pieces. Okay. I don't have any need for these weapons, so I'm just going to leave them here for anybody else. I, I am too. Uh, what weapons are left? There two were... Two scimitars, two battle axes, one short sword, since Chain is taking the other one. <laughs> You have a rusty Shane short sword if you want. Uh, I don't need that. And you're taking a chain shirt as well, right? Sure am. Now, is that the loot for all the bodies in here, or just these front three? That's all six or. Okay. That makes sense, yeah. The others are buried in the rubble. And it looks like there may have been some sort of effort going on to clear them out, as you can see, like piles of dirt uh, and a couple of other spots. But uh, there there are no survivors. Egg, you're proficient in, like, every weapon, right? Are fighters not, or... Oh, I don't, never mind. No. I'm not taking the chainmail. Simple weapons and martial weapons. It's a chain shirt, not chainmail. Oh, okay, that's different. That's why I said chain shirt. My apologies. <laughs> Simple and martial, okay. Yeah. What were they? One more time. There was the it's battle two axe. battle axes, two scimitars, and two sh and one short sword. So, <coughs> uh, I think we ought to put this other orc out of his mi misery. He looks pretty bad. Basically, Homer, you're proficient with any of them. Mm -hmm. They're all martial. None of them are pole arms, which I. The yes. feeling that that's what you were looking for, but mm -hmm. yeah, he might know some stuff that would be useful knowledge. Can he tie a, a scimitar to a stick? No. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I mean, literally, yes, he can make an improvised weapon. Um, I mean, there is somebody carrying a quarterstaff in this group. But, and that is a pole but, arm. But it's my <laughs> quarter staff. Also, it's too short for you. It's technically not. <laughs> it's it's just tall for you. What does finesse mean again? Finesse means that you can use dexterity instead of strength when right, making okay. your attack and damage roll. 
Homer, if you want an opinion, I would take a battle axe for the versatile, but you can take whatever. I will take, um, two battle axes. <laughs> Badass. Okay. I respect that. I'm going to write down that you took two, then. 